Hey guys, hey, just want to do a real quick video here. Um, I know I'd mentioned back, you know, about catching uh, winter beavers and the fact that, you know, the, the casters are, well, being as what they're worth money now, um, you know, they are at their, their peak of their weight. And that, you know, obviously being because they don't have any open water in the winter time they don't put out you know caster mounds in the springtime as soon as that ice opens up they are going to get out there and they will be plastering the countryside with caster mounds so um, you know and the other thing though well here I wanted to show you this first this is the casters right here that I took out of this beaver it's a uh, it's going to be just it'll be a triple X right on the border of it um, but you see here 10 ounces exactly of caster out of one beaver like you know to get a sample and a view look at the size of them compared to my fist and uh, you know so you're looking 10 ounces at the price of the last sale you're looking fifty dollars U.S. just in casters for this beaver, and you know this beaver will obviously be worth probably another forty bucks or so. But the second bonus to catching beavers late in the year like this, you see here. Okay, I want to show you the tail. So as soon as I pulled this beaver out of the water, I knew this was going to be one scarred up looking. Yeah, that looks like kind of dinosaur head, doesn't it? Anyways. Um, this was going to be one scarred up beaver. Well, you look at these scars across his shoulders, his back, down towards his tail. These scars in the fall would have been wide open. When I scraped them, they would have opened right up, and this would definitely be considered a badly damaged beaver. Now, these things might be healed enough that when this animal gets, or the skin gets tanned, it, uh, these scars might not open up. So like I said, another bonus of catching beavers late in the year, because they don't do any fighting in the wintertime, because they don't fight with each other in their house. Their beavers are just fighting with other beavers from another colony when they go to the boundary of their, uh, their areas. Um, they don't do any fighting with their own, you know, colony, so... You know, that's the a second bonus of catching winter beavers. Late winter beavers, anyways. If you catch them early in the winter, obviously those scars won't be healed that much. So, anyway, just wanted to point that out. And uh, catch you later.